All right, well, what I'm talking about is when we practice having some kind of practice routine. I mean, if you're going to be a football player, what do you do? Do you just go play football? No, what do you do? You work first, where you lift weights, you know, you do all that stuff, all right? And then you practice, you work on the different, or baseball. There's five skills in baseball. I used to teach Little League. I played Little League and I coached Little League baseball. There's five skills. You've got to catch the ball, you've got to hit the ball, you've got to throw the ball, you've got to run as fast as the ball, and you've got to know the ball, you've got to know the game. And you break down those five skills and practice, and then you put them together and play. It's the same kind of thing when we practice. And so one of the things I would encourage you to do, and I'm sure your teacher has talked about this with you, is have some kind of practice plan when you practice. Okay? Don't just get your clarinet out and start practicing on music. So what I do, and my practice plan is on the handout, is I work on my basics some, then I work on my scales, and then I start working on practice. Oh, and I also work on my sight reading a little. Everybody circles sight reading under music. Work on your sight reading. Besides, if you haven't practiced enough, you can kind of sight read it. I, at one point in my career, I actually got a piece from a composer just a few days before the world premiere, and I was sight reading it at the concert. I did it. Oh, <laughs> I did it. Because thankfully, I'd been working on my sight reading. So one of the things, and I would work on in the practice routine is I, and I do this myself. I get ready to play. I say, okay. First thing I do is okay. Make sure my clarinet, my reed's working, and then I go, okay. Relaxing my body. Positive. Everybody, everybody, stand up. Let's go. Okay. When it comes to, by the way, I'm teaching fundamentals in case you're not plugged in here. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to, the first thing I do when I warm up in my practice routine, by the way, you see why I'm addressing practice routine? This is going to help you with your with performance anxiety and all that, okay? Okay? Because I think your read's okay, it's just that you're, you know, you're in front of clarinet mic. Ooh. <laughs> I'm famous. Ha <laughs> ha! Not really. <laughs> there's, any, there's no money in it, okay? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, was, I was in Ohio and they said, what's the most important thing as a freelancer? I said, get paid. That's the most important thing. You know. <laughs> Somebody offers you a free lunch, I'm there. Okay. So anyway. Uh, but nevertheless, sorry, I digress. Uh, no, but, but 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 when you're practicing, you gotta work on these things. So all right, I have a little thing I do. I say I tell myself, relax in my body, concentrate in my mind. Oh, and I have hand signals. Here we go. Do this. Relax in your body. There you go. Good, good job. Relax in my body, concentrate in your mind. Relax in your body, concentrate in your mind. Okay? Do it again. Relax in the body, concentrate in your mind. Now play the first measure. Ever see it, buddy? Stop. Oh, very good now. So look, look, hey man, hey. So so don't be like upset at yourself that it wasn't sinless perfection the first time you played. Why do you think you're in school? Yeah! No, I'm serious. Let me talk about that. That is really significant, folks, because, you know, we tend to be in this, you know, not, look, not getting in troubleism and not looking bad. But I think, I think one of the things we want to do is we want to be constantly looking to improve. I was watching baseball a few years ago, and the announcer said, you know, baseball is a game of adjustment. And I went, hey, wait a minute, that's me, <laughs> okay? That's what I do as a clarinet player and everything else, right? Is I want to look to adjust, or everybody write this word down, upgrade. Upgrade. You see, you know, that's a big different world from, man, that was bad. <laughs> that, nobody wants to hear that. That's not really that bad, trust me. Okay. <laughs> no, but, but how about upgrade? Oh yeah, I want upgrade, right? That's what I want. And so I just tried to start training myself. Because remember, the words that we use do matter. The words we use do matter, right? Because they have weight. And so my goal for myself and my career is to continue to upgrade by teaching, by playing, <laughs> being a father, being a husband, okay? I, I want to continue to upgrade and improve, right? And so one of the things I want to encourage you and all of us, and encourage myself, seek upgrade. Because that's where it's at. And right there, I did just a little bit on relaxation, and boy, that tone just came right on out. Fantastic. You can do it, buddy. Thank you. Thank you.